Hi, my name is Dr. Pecoraro. I'm a chiropractor in Westfield, New Jersey. Today I wanted to speak about something that's in uh, one of the letters of St. Paul in the Bible, and it's speaking about husbands and wives. And one part of this, everybody always hears, a part about wives be submissive to your husband. And none of the wives like it, and all the husbands like it whether they say it or not. But everybody always forgets about the second part. The second part of this thing is the part that's important also. It's just as important. It says that husbands love your wives the same way that Christ loved the church. So how did Christ love the church? Christ loved the church enough to die for it. So a husband has to be willing to die for his wife. That's how much he has to love her. Now, I know a lot of husbands will say, well, I'm willing to die for my wife, but I want, to, I want you to think about this. What are you not willing to do for your wife? Are you willing to eat things that she cooks for you that you don't particularly like? Are you willing to watch the television programs that she likes? Uh, are you willing to take her shopping? Are you willing to do things around the house that maybe you'd prefer not to do, that she thinks needs to be done? Now, I'm not saying that you should do these things or not do these things. All I'm saying is that husbands, according to the Bible, should love their wives like Christ loved the church. They should be willing to love them enough to die for them. However, think of things that maybe you're not willing to do for your wife. And according to this passage, you really should be willing to do them. So I hope this gives you something to think about, and I'll try to bring you more information at another time. Thanks.